Hello everyone, it's my honor to attend PTO Jampo Research Competition 2023. My name is Kidong Kim and I received a PhD degree of nuclear engineering from UNIST in Republic of Korea. Now I am working at Kim's. The title of my presentation is a study on directed energy diffusion process of corrosion resistance coating for lead bismuth synthetic environments. As one of the means to respond to global climate change, nuclear energy is being refocused in many countries as a carbon-free energy source that can produce massive energy in any environment. Most currently operating nuclear power plants are Generation 3, which uses light or heavy water as a react coolant. Generation 3 reactors use existing materials and manufacturing technologies listed in the code and can be used well. Generation 4 reactors, which usually have small and modulated designs, have many benefits, such as low operation time without refueling, low land occupancy, and fast manufacturing and insulation. Also, in case of fast reactors that use fast neutrons, Spent fuel storage issues can be dramatically reduced compared with generation three reactors. Small modular reactors use various coolants such as light water, inert gas, liquid metals, molten salt, etc. Among them, lead-based based heavy liquid metals exhibit good heat transfer capability and neutron moderation characteristics. Also, Lead-based heavy, heavy liquid metals have a high boiling point and are chemically stable with air and water. However, liquid metal corrosion issues have been reported using existing structural materials in liquid LB environments. Many researchers have developed LB corrosion resistance materials. Among those materials, alumina forming austenite, iron chrome silicon, iron chrome al aluminum alloy systems are candidate materials with high LB corrosion resistance. For newly developed materials to use pressure retaining parts of nuclear reactors, 10% or less surface thickness in cladding or coating is permitted in the view of system safety design. Also, surface coating on the final product with precise dimensions is preferred to avoid harsh post-processing, such as extrusion and figuring. In this study, the directed energy deposition process using alumina forming austenite alloy and iron 12, iron 12 chrome 2 silicon powders was carried out to make an LB corrosion resistance layer on the surface of candidate material for pure cladding, stainless 316L. This video is about the DED process which I conducted. The goal of my research is to develop the thin surface coating of LB corrosion resistance material to base material with final dimensions to overcome the barriers of post-processing and code register. The optimized DED parameters were suggested for defect-free and restricted base metal dilution through the investigations of microstructures, mechanical properties, and corrosion properties, including LB exposure tests of the coated layers. Finally, feasibility was verified to build a thin surface coating of LB corrosion resistance materials on the final size of fuel cladding using rotating tube DED process with optimized process variables. I will finish my presentation with this DED process video. Thank you for your attention. 